Hello and welcome viewers! Haha, <laughs> we've just taken down Lorelei and it's time to get through some more of the Elite Four! Here is Bruno, and I know what you're thinking, yes he does look like a shirtless Eric Cartman. And also, he's not very good. I think he's probably the worst member of the Elite Four. People and Pokemon can become stronger. I've weight trained with my Pokemon. Doesn't mean you're going to be a good trainer. Uh, he uses a combination of psychic, psychic, fighting and rock type Pokemon. So, yeah. He's got a Hitmonchan, a Hitmonlee, and uh, I think he has two Onyxes and a Machamp. So, it's nothing frightening, to be honest. In fact, he's like... He hasn't even got any new Pokemon. At least Lorelei had some new Pokemon that were actually tough. This guy has Pokemon, two Pokemon that the first gym had, two Pokemon that. Oh, okay, he has Machamp. I guess that's new, but Machamp isn't that difficult. Hitmon Lee and Hitmon Chan are just going to get destroyed. You one chance to hit me, and you use an X Defend. Or I think he used an X Defend. I wasn't looking at the screen at the time, but oh well. <laughs> Oh, I hit my chan. Yep, I think we'll send Joby out to handle you. Yeah, I don't want to use Mew that much. And another X defend. Jesus Christ. Oh my God! Do you do anything apart from use X defends? I have to use a special attack now. Oh wait, I forgot his special paper thin. Why didn't I just use that in the first place? And Hitmon Lee. Uh yeah, we'll have a, we'll have an Asian take down Hitmon Lee. I love that stance from Hitmon Lee. It looks like he's just tripped over and he's like, Oh god, this is gonna go so wrong. Oh good, double team, at least you're being a noob. At least my surf hit straight away. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh! And another X defend? What is wrong with you, Bruno? You haven't laid a finger on me because you keep X defending every other turn. Way, nice one, Asian. Level 46. And Onyx. I think we'll have. Yeah, I think we'll leave Asian in. In hindsight, it would have been nice to use uh, Desmond in this battle, but no, he's not needed that much. Come on, yeah! And his last Pokemon, Machamp. I think I'm going to use Mew. I'll only use Mew on the last Pokemon that's like really difficult, because have you seen how under level I am? I'm level 43 against a level 58. But this Psychic should either kill it or definitely harm it a lot. Oh, you see, it harmed it a lot. Oh, karate chop, let's see how much it takes off. Bloody hell! Well, I guess you do have a 15 level advantage and it was a critical hit, so... Yeah, you are a beast, you, I'm sorry. Ah, uh, we're level 44. And there, shirtless Eric Cartman is down. How could I lose? Because you shit types. Go face your next chat. Don't get on Marty just because you lost. Right. I'm going to put Joby at the top here. And I'm going to use a max potion on JK. Next in, next of the Elite Four is Agatha. She uses predominantly poison and ghost types. And she's apparently Professor Oaks' old friend. Oak's taken a lot of interest in you, child. That old duff was one tough and handsome. That was decades ago. <laughs> Middle with his Pokedex. You know, she actually has a lot of good ideals about Pokemon just being for fighting. I like you. Even though you do look like a batty old woman, but oh well. Right, she starts off with a Gengar. Level 56. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Oh, ho -ho, that was a good play. That was a good play game. I was actually going for flamethrower there. That was a really good play game. What? Ah, <laughs> but <laughs> oh yeah, you see, I think she's got some of the. Worst. 
This is the Elite Four, and I'm versing a person with a goal bat. It could only get worse if she has something like an Arbok or something. She does have an Arbok. Okay, will you let me use Earthquake on your Gengar now? No, okay, maybe not. Well, at least you sent it. You've just given me a free turn to hurt Haunter. You're not a good trainer at all. What the hell? <laughs> what is she doing? You know what? I'm going to send out Asian because he has dig. Yeah, now what are you going to do? Oh, I sweat. I bet he gets the Parahax. It's a 30% chance, but it always happens against you. You have a Gengar with Lick and Mega Drain. Oh, you're such a useless trainer. Ha 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 ha! Finally hit this freaking Gengar. At least, you, at least you can't get the Parahax if I'm already paralyzed. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, substitute, it takes out 25% of your HP, but makes... Uh, Stop it! It makes a body, a body double of you. This Gengar has been so awkward! Oh, my, just die! Ha 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 ha! But, uh, yeah, the substitute can then take damage for you, so it's quite useful, but... Thank God! An Arbok! Oh, no! Yeah, an, a level 58 Arbok at this time in the game isn't challenging at all. Apart from it does... Oh, God! Oh, phew! Oh, if it had got rap on then, I would have screamed. What it does, basically, this Arbok, is screech and then just spam rap. <laughs> that's all. That's all Arbok's ever good for, really. In this game, anyway, it's useless now. Well, I don't know, but I know it's Cobra backwards. And last but not least. Because there's only three ghost types in the game, she has a second Gengar. So let's review her team. She had a Gengar, a Haunter, a Gengar, a Gobat, and an Arbok. What an inventive team! But yeah, because this one's level 60, you know the drill. Why are you... I'm a psychic type. You could have used... Oh wait, Lick's not very... Right, come on. Come on. Actually, he took up a big chunk, but it is psychic, I guess. And Gengar does a beastly special. I got a critical and he didn't even... <laughs> uh, um, sorry about my voice there. I think you just dug your own grave there, Gengar. <laughs> yes, there is the... Third of the <laughs> Elite Four down. You're something special, child. Thank you, I know. You win. I see what the old Duff sees in you now. I have nothing else to say. Run along now, child. Okay, well... I'm going to heal up. I'll have to use a full restore here to get Asian back up to full health. And a max potion on JK. Right, now we go on to the fourth of the Elite Four. Lance, the Dragon Master. And I this this is the one battle which I prepared Mew for throughout the whole game. Because I knew I was gonna be under level. This is a sort of under leveled run. Right? So the reason I gave Mew Ice Beam is because of this. Are you ready, Pikachu? Stay down the last of the Elite Four. Right then. Hello, Lance. I heard about you, Geezer. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance, the Dragon Trainer. You know that dragons are mythical Pokemon. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible. Well, are you ready to lose? Your League Challenge ends with me, Geezer. Well, here is Lance, the Dragon Master. He's pretty difficult. He starts off with a Gyarados, which I always sh said that it should have been a Dragon type. But it's got four times weakness to Electric, so any Electric type will be perfect here. And it has I know it has the move Dragon Rage, so that's only going to take 40 off me. 
So at least Pikachu's frail and terrible defences aren't going to get, um, well, bitten into. And that's Gyarados down. Next he has a Dragonair. Dragonair is a pretty good, pretty useless for this type in the game. But because it doesn't have a four times weakness to ice, such as Dragonite, it's going to be more difficult to take down. And it does like using Thunder Wave. Oh, oh, Hyper Beam. Oh, Hyper Beam. Hyper Beam's. Um, oh, what's the word I'm looking for in my head? Animation is so awesome. But Hyper Beam's a 150 power move, but once you use it, you can't do another move for a turn. So. Well, here's his second Dragonair. So, I think this is the one with Thunder Wave, because I can remember being Thunder Waved. Oh no, he has Ice Beam as well. Please don't get the freeze. Oh my god. Oh my god! Does it... I have to use a full restore here, guys, because freeze, you cannot... If you're in a competitive battle and you get frozen, then there's... I think... If you get another freeze, I swear to god... What the f... There's a 10% chance! I swear to god, if you get third... Oh, at least you use Bubble Beam this time. Two freezes in a row! You lucky... <clears throat> person! Right, there's Dragonair down. Nice one, JK. That's going to help with the last person here. Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl is... In Pokemon Gold and Silver... Oh, a heart gold and soul silver. I cannot stand this Aerodactyl. But, he isn't, his special is just worthless, so. Oh, I never get the freezer. You! Why are you making me worse my ice beam? Well, at least he didn't kill me. Right, this psychic should kill him. Right, there we go. Now we only have to worry about his last Pokemon, which is Dragonite. And I'm not going to change Pokemon, I think we'll be alright. Alright, uh, right, th this is what my League Challenge ends or Oh, so close! Whoa, oh shit! Right, this has now become very difficult. A level 62 Dragonite is probably going to destroy my team. Asian, I gave you Blizzard for a reason. Right, come on. Oh, Jesus Christ, thunder! Come on, live, 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 live. Oh my God, I love you! Oh, <laughs> Blastoise, you've just got us through the Elite Four. Not only did you, Blastoise, have come through for me there, I hate to admit it, but you are a Pokemon master. Thanks to Asian. I still can't believe my dragons lost to you, Geezer. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or oh, you would have been, but you have one more challenge ahead. You have to face another trainer. It Connor! Oh, I knew you'd do something like that to me. Yes, viewers, that is the twist in this game. Connor is actually the champion of the Elite Four. And in the next episode, we will be taking down Connor and becoming the Pokemon League champion. My common question of the day to you, viewers, is which do you think was the most useless Pokemon the Elite Four members had? It was that Arbok. Even though it tried wrapping me, that Arbok was useless. So this is Giza, and next time, we will become the Pokemon League Champion.